year his great, uh, what, eighth show, this is the eighth show this weekend as part of the entertainment arena, the action arena. Out on the front, there he is, feet up as well as he leads right over the body. We have to always stand. Come on, please, make some noise. <laughs> He had his own soundtrack, he was just checking out. He was just sort of listening to Enya while he does his pretty head and free stuff. Here we go, up on the back. Now this is how, if you hang your bike up in the garage, yep, turn it on and off to work. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine what that would be like if you were the wife standing out there on the balcony, mixing, getting tea ready for the night, and then your husband just heroically rides off into the distance. <laughs> Impressive stuff from Dave McKenna. See, that's the way to do it. And I think just almost one last time that he's going to come past us. How about we show our appreciation, ladies and gentlemen. Dave McKenna, the boy from Ballarat. Do one last victory lap. Well, just one last thing. We've got a little bit of time. I'm going to see if I'm just Who'd like to learn how to do the stopping and endo? Just get a little bit of a tutorial right at the line Alright, breaking right down the three stages, the first thing that we're going to be looking at is these front shots, right? You're going to feel that out. Yeah, that's it. So when you get hard on the brake, the front end is going to compress. And when that compresses, that's when you want to uh, you know, put all your weight on it and turn the bike off. It's just going to wash out on you. So it's just going to be really smooth and start off small. Start off small. So you'll do it in three stages. You'll feel it out. Now just keep your eyes on the front shots. See how far they can press, that's what he'll be feeling out for. And then as he does that a little bit, gets a little bit of a feel for it there, he'll go, okay, now I'm going to put my body into it. We'll go a little bit further. And then the third time around, that's when we'll see just how far he can go to reach that balance point. So just feel it, watch the front shots. Just feels where they bottom out. You may have noticed there too, just how hard that back wheel's coming down. You'll notice when he totally perfects it, that the back wheel doesn't come down at all. It's all to do with the way he uses the brake so that the chain doesn't slap. Here we go. A little bit more now. He's getting used to it. Now to the last day, but I've had a time to do that. Maybe 200, maybe 300 attempts just at checking how far the front suspension's going to compress. So now he's got the confidence, so we're doing a, a really sped up timeline of how to learn this trick. That's the first part, and now he's got to the extent of pushing it up. Now this time, let's see what he can do with it. He's up to about 70 k's an hour there, feel the front wheel wobble, and that is how you do a stopping, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah.